it's not actually clear that the human body really needs a human spirit any more than a horse really has to have a rider. A horse which has a rider will have different experiences than a horse which does not have a rider. The human body is actually the same. But um, the main cause of war and the main cause of fighting, uh, the main cause of almost all problems is a war between the spirit and the body where the body actually invents spiritual values and invent arguments to avoid being dominated by the spirit. So to do this it creates an ego. An ego says, I am this, I am that. You know, and this ego, because it's not real, wants to prove it's real. Like Pinocchio, wants to be a real boy. So the ego tries to uh, make itself important for example, like in the tower card of the tarot, there were two figures displaced, and the one with the crown is much further away from the drops of illumination. That's the, the one that needs a crown. I am so big as the ego. And the illumination arrives to it later. The more intuitive mind is immediately illuminated because the drops of illumination are right there, and the ego learns slower because it wants to be important. Most human interactions are actually egos playing masks with egos. They create an identity to be visible to other people, and the other people create an identity back so that they, um, it's really just masks operating with masks. That, in fact, is uh, one thing that we master in the trances training how to actually. Uh, see another person for real, which almost never happens on Earth. <laughs>